Hi, kids. Hello, hey. Tony. Hey, Tony. Hey. I had a frog in my throat. <laughs> um, ribbit, ribbit. Thank, thank God that was it. <laughs> that was an old joke. I swallowed Czechoslovakia and I've got a frog in my throat. <laughs> Sorry. <Ba -dum> <laughs> Congratulations on Ultraman. Wow. Uh, oh, thank you. Thank I'll tell you. you what, I mean, I, you know, I've got adult kids who have grown up on uh, on the Ultraman series and, and wow. all, and they're just raving about it because it's so much like the original series. It's got that feel. Yeah. Um, I'll start with uh, with the lovely Tamla. Yes. Um, you know, yes, you, you're an accomplished actress. You've done just about everything. Um, is voice acting totally different it is totally different <laughs> oh my god i don't get the i don't get the 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 the, necess, uh, the, necess, the necessity of working with these actors in the room and getting to look in their face while we're saying these lines it's like oh my god why did you do that or oh my god can't you do better you have to do it in a booth by yourself in front of a team of people that you hardly know and you're separated by a pane of glass and there's silence unless they push the button and say, hey, Tam, could you do this again this way? Mm -hmm. So it was, it was very, very different. It really required the exercise of our imaginations. And you know, when we get to work with each other on those very few occasions when we were in the room together, it was like, oh my God, you do look like exactly what I thought Kenji Sato <laughs> would look like. And it was, a, it was a real joy, but voice acting, boy, wow. It's, it's got its pros and cons like any other art form. Uh, Getty, uh, first of all, wow, I, I'm so honored just to talk with you. I mean, you're in some of my favorite movies, yes. Gung Ho, UHF, of course, uh, Thank uh, you. 16 Candles. I mean, I, I can go on. Um, and your character, Professor uh, Soto, is he's an amazingly deep character, and you mm. do so much with that rich voice of you. Oh, thank you. I Well, I appreciate that. I, I, uh, I was pretty much a novice to the whole process because uh, we didn't we didn't really get the script so <laughs> it, unlike some people <laughs> so er, sorry go ahead get the script or you didn't get the script we didn't get oh no 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 oh i'm sorry uh the good good point uh no the actual physical lines you know were came to us with each different session for well for me particularly mm -hmm. yeah. for me too and oh, for you oh that's right yeah. and so what happened was that uh, I had, it was a learning curve yeah. for me completely because every corner uh, was a turnaround. Then all of a sudden, when we actually saw the whole piece, I was stunned. Mm -hmm. I didn't know what to do. I was just totally blown away by it because okay. you just don't know what you have. Uh, Chris, uh, your character, uh, Ken, I mean, he's on the hero's journey. He's... That's kind right. of a reluctant hero, Joseph isn't Campbell. he? Yeah, he, he's definitely the, um, the, the, the reluctant hero. But again, <laughs> um, as you know, I'm working with legendary talent, um, Tamlin, Getty, and Oscar-winning production company like Industrial Light and Magic, Shannon Tyndall, John Aoshima, Brett, Lisa, Tom, the entire team guiding myself and helping create, collaborate, and and uh, bring to the audience Kenji Sato. So it's it's been a, quite the journey, and, and I've I've grown a lot, and I love this character. He is a, a terrific character. Tim, I'm going to give you the last word. What do you think audiences are going to discover uh, when they watch this ultra this new Ultraman Rising? That we're all striving to be connected. I think that we're all saying about what does this story mean? It's about family, it's about superheroes, about sacrifice, it's about hero ship, but it's all about connecting. It's all about seeking love and support and care from one another because the more you give, the more you receive. And that you'll see within the character of Kenji Sato is that you know, not only caring for little baby Emmy, baby Kaiju, he's also caring for his parents, caring for Emmy uh, and caring for baby Emmy for this this little baby kaiju that we're all going to fall in love with, but that we're all connected in this world. And I think that's the universal story here. I think so too. Uh, our time is over. I could talk to you for five more hours. Tony, God bless you. you. I love you all. And uh, Tam, I loved you in Stargate, loved you in uh, <laughs> After Tomorrow. 
Thank you. Yeah. Thank you so and much, You guys Tony. take care. Have a great day. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you.